Okay. Got the ermine. Ermine form. So we're going to try to mount this guy up. Got the eyes kind of just thrown in there. Still got to do the clay work. So, got my cuts made for tucking skin. So, all right, we'll see what I come up with. All right, guys. Well, there is a skinned out ermine. And as you can see, I split them down the back. So that way, it's going to be just like putting on a pair of pants. The legs will just slide right in, and the head will slide over, and the tail will slide in. Kind of hard to do all this one-handed, but I'll, uh, I'll put the head on it real fast and kind of give you an idea. Okay, now it's just kind of thrown on there real fast. As you can see, my eyes are off just a little bit. The skin is starting to dry out some, so... And then you just pull it together and stitch it together in the back all the way down to the base of the tail so but i'm gonna put this way and work on it some more later so we'll see you on the next segment don't know how well you can see that but right there trying to split this ermine's lips that was pretty hard. You know, you got a good view of this thing to just focus. There you go. You can see it right there, all the way around. A little bit more flushing, and you done with that? Ready to mount? That was a pain in the butt. Flipping these back feet. Turning them back right side out sucked. But they're filled up with clay now, along with the fronts. So, getting ready to put it on the form. All right, see how long that takes me. Now, well, if that wasn't a pain in my butt, I don't know what was. So, had to go through and reshape the form around the shoulders and on the head. So I'm going to stitch it up along the back and then get everything where I want it. The front paws, back paws, tuck some skin up in the armpits and then uh, set the face. It's kind of creepy like that. So yeah, we'll tuck those inner eyelids in. All right, well, I'm going to get sewing. All right, well. All stitched up. Now for the face work. Some clay for the nose. And then uh, we'll start pinning the eyes and glue the lips down in place. And then we'll uh, set the feet and everything once I get it on the base, which is right there. So, all right. And just sliding the lips over. You can see it right there. How the, how I split the lips. So that way they get tucked in the mouth slot down there. All right, there is Mr. Ehrman. Now he's gonna stay looking like a guy from Hellraiser until he's all dried up. And then pull the cards off his ears and Make it look like he doesn't have a bloody nose or smoke or something funny at that angle. So, eh, maybe reposition the front paws a little bit. But, yeah, not too bad. I'm happy with it. Anyway, it's something fun to do. But, yeah, give him uh, probably two weeks to dry up all the way and. Put them on the wall.